Hey, what's up, guys? Sonic says, I'm here, guys. Part two of our playthrough of Sonic and the Secret Rings for the Nintendo Wii. Last year, we kicked off this playthrough by doing Lost Prologue, watching the opening. So now we're going to move on to the second world, which is Sand Oasis, a desert strewn with ruins. And our objective is to find King Shariar first. And we might just like. We'll just like probably keep this. Keep one ring equipped. Even though, there, even though there's like two of them, but we, we really don't need two of them. There's only four of them. But we'll try to just keep one ring equipped right now, to be honest with you. If I need another one, I will. Three, two, one. And we are off here. Yeah, right now pearls are useless, but they, you know, obviously they'll have a good use later on. When we get speed break and time break, uh, there they will be useful. Until then, pearls are literally useless. So just you can collect them, you can't collect them, doesn't matter. We got to at least get to Evil Foundry, which is the fourth world, though. And then obviously you guys should know what exactly this game has in store for us. Well, I thought there could have been something up there, but it turns out that it looks like there wasn't. We don't need pearls, Shara, right now. I, t I just I just got done explaining this. Dad gummit. Yeah, those silver rings are different stars. Those are super rings. They're worth 20 rings. So if you see them, make sure you try to pick them up. Yeah. You gotta wait till later on you get a new ability before you can get that fire still up there, but this is not a 100 percent playthrough, so we're not going after all of them. But if we get a chance, I will try to collect them. I just hope Sonic get this one right here. Got it! They do unlock, I think they do unlock, like, they will get you some extra stuff if you collect enough of them. Yeah, the idea, they unlock characters in party mode, because if I'm not mistaken, the, the four unlockable characters are what? Shadow, Cream, Silver, and Blaze. Yeah, it'd be probably a little bit faster than that one here, actually. I'm not doing it very carefully. Is Sandy gonna make it? Yeah, barely makes it. <laughs>
And there we go, guys. We made it. We're taking on towards the palace. You know, so the bronze bell took about four and a half minutes. Not too big. And so it's mini turbo. Look at the we remote for when countdown is at one for a boost. Fit in that jar, though. What's Dr. Eggman doing here? Aha! I knew it! This is all another one of your schemes! What is the meaning of this? I am Shoryar, king of this land! Eggman, what are you up to this time? What a wait! You're making a mistake! This is him! This is King Shoryar! Really? Such insolence! Guard! Seize this blue spiky thing at once! Where are your men, Your Highness? Oh, that's right. Let me explain. When the evil spirits appeared out of nowhere, everyone turned and ran. And I was just having to hide in that jar. Yes. Guess it's time for a little action. What well, that's not Eggman. Perhaps not. But we're supposed to die our chances. Don't get to feed. In other words, don't die. We're here. That's shouldn't be a problem. There we go. Of course, obviously, it's going to throw everything at it. Everything this game has got is going to come at us in this mission because it's trying to kill us, obviously. Also, because the fire genies are a lot more difficult to kill for obvious reasons because they spit fire. No, Sanic, we need you to. No, I want this. I wanted that, you know, it might have cost some metal, but I wanted it. Pearl Collector tracks nearby pearls. We don't need that yet. It's just like we obviously don't need that one yet, so it's kind of useless. We don't need it. So don't break the jar. I remember this mission so many times because I hated this mission so much because it was so annoying. I just didn't like this. Mission. Like, you know, don't break the jar. But again, this is this is a key mission here because this advances the story because there's a cutscene after this one. Has to be done. 
Okay, so don't break any of the jars. Break one jar, and of course, you know, obviously the mission's over. You fail, you gotta restart, so we have freaking no jars. Are you ready? Sure. Okay, wrong jar. There's a fire soul above the other one on the left. You gotta be really careful, though. If you go for it, don't break the jar, obviously. So word of words of advice, do not break the jaws. The good news is if you die, you don't you know, if you actually fall off the course and die. Like it doesn't make you restart to that, which is very nice, the game. I thought it was one of those genies that just like actually like disappeared. That's what they do though. They'll, they'll literally disappear because they just suck like that. Oh gosh. Those... Yeah, play it safe and just try to jump dash by the jars. So you can obviously get by that one, right? And there we go, made it through it. Turbo boost accelerate acceleration rate, the top speed increases. There we go, that's a that's a big one. Got, don't get defeated and then break five jars. Alright, so we're gonna. See, the pearl one even takes four. It takes four points to equip anyway, so. It's kind of, like I said, useless right now. It's not going to be needed for probably about another video or two, so I can tell. Until after we, you know, unlock the speed break and time break ability. Till then, pearls are useless to us. We don't need them. Like I said, see, obviously it sees it right there. Is it Sonic? Reaches top speed a lot faster. Of course, eventually, you know later on, there are abilities that make Sonic run really fast, which is. I don't Sonic stop because I don't. I do not trust those guys. Uh, I don't know about this. Yeah, see, okay, yeah, we're going to have to be super careful here. Oh god! Oh! And I was like, what the heck? Is this a Sonic, what are you doing, dude? No. Stay below, stay low. But it rings. And hopefully we'll get through this A okay. Yeah. 
Rings, it's okay. So we need some rings. And we made it. There you go, made it. One piece is good enough for me. You've been told the max rings goes up. Back step. Press the two button while moving back to back step. You don't really need that one either because it's not really not really necessary. I don't find it useful either. So. Bingo. Dinosaur Jungle has been added to the world select list. Quite going there, yes. So he's collecting 99 rings and he's going to get a challenge. So. There we go, got ourselves a silver medal as well. That's even better. See, fire set. Increase the type of power granted to back step. That's still not necessary. Defeat 20 enemies.
<laughs> okay, fine, we're not gonna go out there. Just made it, guys. We're going to finish in two minutes. Exactly. Ideal right there. With 29 seconds spare, we made it. Quick step. Ground over to left or right becomes smoother. So we got ourselves our first boss battle of the game, which is against the Sand Scorpion here. Which, by the way, I think we need to customize our next move, right?
There we go. So we have some moving, you know, around will be a little bit easier with that equipped. So that's good. Come on, man, that ain't cool. And he has been wrecked to the place of a gold medal. Quick air. <laughs> our first world ring which is the yellow one I'm going to I need to equip some we're going to go and equip that movie right quick but anyways guys that is going to go in and wrap it up for this video so if you guys liked it make sure to like button and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in the next video peace out guys